Tonight, a family wants answers after the death of this 41-year-old man. Police say he was found shot in his car in the middle of the day along Anderson Street in Orlando. News 6's Troy Campbell joins us not far from that scene at the Orlando Police Headquarters tonight. Detectives here at the Orlando Police Department say the victim was found shot in the middle of the day, just a few blocks from where we are standing right now. Tonight, his family is asking for anyone with information to come forward. He touched all of our hearts and our lives in ways that it's 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 in um, unsurpassable amounts. The family of 41 year old Eloy LeBron telling News 6 Thursday evening officers knocked on their door, telling them LeBron had been killed. It wasn't just another number, somebody who, who succumbed to um, the unfortunate events that are happening um, you know, in the world we live in today. He was a very good person. Orlando police say their officers were called to the area of Anderson Street and Jernigan Avenue just after 1230 Thursday afternoon. Investigators say LeBron was found shot dead inside of his car. His family says he worked as a flight attendant and also told them he loved them every day. And everybody that knew him and got to know him enjoyed to be with him. And he cared about his family and pretty much everybody. The family says they are seeking justice. We want this to stop. It's enough what we we're going through. So please, I beg if you guys seen anything, know anything, they don't have to say names. All they have is to call. Detectives say that they are actively working this case and they ask anyone with information to call Crime Line. Outside Orlando Police Headquarters, Troy Campbell, Getting Results, News 6.